those who are having uh, unresolved uh, uh, memories of uh, difficult situations or circumstances or conditions or experiences or unwanted experiences, uh, unpleasant experiences, unpleasant interactions with others, quarrels, misunderstandings, memories of that which are unresolved and which, which has made a imprint on the mind, either karmic imprint or uh, um, uh, situational imprint, which is difficult to erase. The question is, what are the Buddhist recommendations for erasing such uh, imprints, such memories, resolving such situations, and amicably settling the difference? OK. Um, so this is a very practical question. One thing is that in the practice of Buddhism, there is what is known as transforming the adverse situations into the path. In, in other words, any difficult situation, methods and means to change them into spiritual uh, development. In other words, transforming the adverse conditions into opportunities. So we need to acquire that skill. If you acquire that skill, then all these unresolved past memories, there are no more unresolved past memories. They are like a great opportunity for you to grow further. This is one of the practices, which, um, uh, which uh, this is one of the, this is a part of the practice of Tonglen. In Tonglen, you particularly you take the miseries of others onto yourself, and then the difficult, difficult people, uh, particularly what made these people difficult, because they are difficult people, they are not happy themselves. Because they, why they are unhappy themselves is because of these problems which they have, which is reflected in the form of making others uh, uneasy and unhappy. So then you feel exceptional, exceptionally great compassion towards them, seeing that they are in difficult situations because they are creating pain on you. The fact that they are creating pain on you is because they are unhappy. Yeah. So there's um, a whole set of teaching known as Lojong, Lojong uh, practice. Lojong means mind training. Mind training practice, whereby you train your mind to change the adverse, difficult situations into the opportunities and into the conducive factors for your spiritual growth. Uh, and the, the continuation of uh, that same topic for converting or convert if they're converting may not you said changing the adverse situation into um, situation of opportunities but that would require the conscious and uh, 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 involved uh, support of very evolved masters and deities and devis and devas and lamas and buddhas and um, venerables and holy people because the methodology has to be learned. Is there any single text or group of texts or books which teaches yes, how, yes. To, how to? Mind training. There is a whole genre. There's a whole genre on mind training. Mind training is the main topic. Under this topic, there are so many writings by the great masters, like Adishti Pankara, Eight Verses of Mind Training, Seven Point Mind Training, Mind Training of the Sharp Wheel, Sun's Rays Like Mind Training. There are so many of these books available. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Welcome.